West Central Georgia. It's roadway resurfacing season. And all throughout West Central Georgia, we see roadway resurfacing projects underway. Large projects like right here at I-85 in Troop County, smaller projects on state routes throughout the district. That's why we're starting to see some comments from a lot of folks lately. Why are you doing so many roadway resurfacing projects in the summertime? Don't you know folks have vacations, it's a high traffic volume time, isn't that inconvenient? How come you have to do them now? Well, those are good questions and hopefully I can give you some answers right now. Really, it boils down to two things. One, scheduling, and two, the weather. First, scheduling. If you look at the calendar year, we really have no seasons that don't have any potentially high volume traffic times. In the spring, we've got spring break weeks. In the summertime, we've got Memorial Day weekend, we've got Labor Day weekend, we've got Fourth of July. In the fall, we've got fall break weeks, as well as Thanksgiving weekend. In the wintertime, we have Christmas weekend, New Year's Eve weekend, and there are a few three-day weekends scattered in there. So really have no long stretches of time where a long roadway project can be done without hitting some time of high traffic. It's just impossible. So, when we're dealing with projects that could be one or two months long for some of the smaller projects, to projects that are six months long or longer, like here at I-85, we have to look at whole seasons and sometimes overlapping. And that's where the second factor pops in, the weather. One fun fact, asphalt must be laid when the ground temperature is at least above, at the very least, 45 degrees, which eliminates part of our winter season. In addition, we have to look for periods of dry, consistent weather, which really eliminates most of winter. So winter, we're just not even looking at you for scheduling. When we look at spring or we look at fall, those seasons are likely to have prolonged periods of rain, and sometimes we get sleet in there as well. So spring and fall are all right, but that leaves summer as our prime time for resurfacing roadways. Sometimes with the larger projects like here, this project is six months long. We have to extend either into the spring or partway into the fall, but summer is prime time for roadway resurfacing. If we have projects go long because of prolonged negative weather that adds time to the project, it also adds cost. Nobody likes those two extra things at all. I'm sure you don't, we don't either. We at the Georgia DOT are good stewards of the state's time and money. We always look at those factors whenever we are working for you.